Hello. Hi guys, good evening. Hello, teacher. How are you tonight? Very good. Hi, teacher. Hi. What's new? <laughs> I only hear people <laughs> taking deep breaths, <laughs> breathing heavily. What does that mean? <laughs> Are you guys tired? Little. All right, I see everyone. So, welcome guys to another class. Thank you for being with me tonight and for joining me. The rest of your classmates, I am going to definitely contact you. There are so many apps. Right. So, are you ready? Ready for another class? Yes. Okay, well, uh, as always, we're going to start actually no we're not gonna start with the platform tonight but we are gonna watch the video we were looking at last night again all right that's what we're gonna do so i told you that tonight we were gonna practice relative clauses right let's see um this is what we were practicing so i will play the video again if you didn't take notes last night take notes again please pay close attention because we're about to practice this in a second okay here we go we can watch a different one this time <clears throat> so listen guys don't pay attention to defining or non-defining it doesn't matter okay just pay attention to who what when that's what i want you to pay attention to okay everything else forget about it right let's watch non-defining relative clauses are used when the information is important in specifying what is being discussed. Non-defining relative clauses are used when the information is unnecessary or extra. Remember that non-defining relative clauses always use commas. Here's an example of a non-defining clause. My brother, comma, who is a police officer, comma, lives in New York. Here, in this example, I have one brother. He is a police officer who lives in New York. If we look at this example of a defining relative clause, notice that we don't use commas. My brother, who works as a police officer, lives in New York. In this example, I have more than one brother and I am talking specifically about the brother who is a police officer. Here's another example of a non-defining relative clause. The students, comma, who passed the test, comma, had a party. In this situation, this means that every student in the class passed the test and every student in the class will be having a party. Notice the difference in this defining relative clause. Here we don't use commas. The students who passed the test had a party. This means that not every student passed the test and only the students who passed were the students who had a party. Okay. And that's why I was saying, don't pay attention to defining, non-defining, it's not important. Just pay attention to how to use who, when, what other WH words do we have? What, which, why, why, why <laughs> who, who's, very good. 
I think you're ready to practice. Uh, let me ask you one question. Okay, when do we use who to talk about what? When you're talking about people. Talking about people. Very good. When do we use when? When talk you're about talking me? about time. 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 Also, when do we talk about? When do we say where? Talking about places. 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 What about who's? Uh, when you're talking about possession. Yes, possession. Okay. What about why? Question. Sorry? Question. It's like a, a reason. Reason. Yes, very good. Reason. And how? When you're talking about the manner, right, the way something is done, sometimes when you're talking about a process, okay, and so on. Now, um, let's practice together. This is not in the platform, okay? It's not included, but I'm giving you additional information and additional practice to understand this topic because you will be studying this topic this module and next module. So it's to help you out. Okay. Um, look, let me open the file. We're going to do an exercise here. And we can do it all together as a class, all right? Help me define what the relative clause is. Here it is. Pay attention for everyone. It's loading. Let it load. Let it load. I'm changing the song. Okay, here are some of them. Look. Some of the relative clauses, these are the answers. Let's read them. Okay, you want to read them, Andrea Guzman? Okay. Uh, relative pronouns. Who, why, when, which, whose, where, and what. Very good, thank you. Well, I gave you the first answer already, as always. Okay, I will say a name. Be ready, guys. Be ready to unmute the microphone because I will have everybody will participate, okay? And Richard, this way. Richard? No. All right, go ahead. Number one. House, place, you need to mind in hotel. Uh-huh. So what can I use? What, when, where, who's? Which. Yes, which, exactly. Which. The house, which where? is. Which. No, guys, you can think in Spanish about this topic if you want to. What is better to say? La casa donde está al lado mío o la casa que está al lado mío? Which one is right? Okay. Uh huh. Exactly. So we're not. We cannot use where in this context, right? So we're gonna use which. Okay. We can use that too. You can also use that. Yes. Exactly. That. Mm -hmm. But not where. Sure. Even though it's a place. So which is the answer? Very good. Next one, Irani. Be ready to unmute the microphone. That's the hotel we spend your honeymoon. Mm -hmm. mm. 
where? What do you say, everyone? Where is the answer? Where? Yes, where? That's the hotel where we spent our honeymoon, right? Yes, very good. Okay, next. Delia. There is some um, where where we why why we stop stop enjoying the that restaurant was because. So the reason why? Why we? Hmm? The reason why we? Yes, exactly. That's the one. Very good. Okay. Next, Amilcar. The teacher was mentioned at the meeting is over there. Remember, these are the options. I'm going to write them here. So the options we said, what, right? What do you think, Amilcar? Who? Yes, exactly. We have what, when, who, who's, which, where, why. And I think I'm missing how. How, yeah. Okay, so the teacher, the teacher who? Uh -huh. Yes, who? We're uh -huh. talking about the teacher, about a person. Okay, very good. Rebecca, next one. The town, the town where they live is by the sea. Uh -huh. Yes, great. Pedro? Very good. What you mean? What? Exactly. I understand what you mean. Carla de Marín. Oh, I don't hear you. Yes, I hear you. Um, is that uh, why? Is that why you decide? not to the, go there anymore right is that why hey, stephanie jenny mm -hmm. oh this is not this time now Uh, uh, oh, I don't know. We need help from the public. <laughs> help from the audience. What do you guys think? Ooh, Ooh exactly. And you can think about it in Spanish because it, it's the same, all right? Jenny, cuyo padre. Eso. Cuyo padre, what does it say? Es un juez, okay, so it's the same, right? Whose father? Very good, okay, Vladi. Can you see the man who is standing at the bus stop? Who is standing at the bus stop? Can you see the man who, okay, connect this guys, this S with this other S here. So you make one S, right, is standing. Say it, is standing. Standing. Yes, bus stop. Bus stop. Mm -hmm. Yes, very good. Okay, uh, one more, the last one. Claudia Rivas. The restaurant 
The restaurant where we have lunch yesterday was in the papers this morning. Perfect. The answer is where. Okay. Um, is it clear? Or do you need more examples? What do you think? It was clear, teacher, for me. Clear? Who else? Who says... Hold on. Who says it was not clear? Raise your hand. Carla. <laughs> okay. Yeah, pay attention to what it is. Okay. Let's see, Carla. Let's see how you do. I will give you two exercises here. All right, Carla, do this one. Uh, well, um, who is on the French Riviera? But who is for people? Um, we also... Just like the questions, right? Mm -hmm. so oh, what do you think place? it is? Um, mm. It's a place, but, it, but you can also use which for places. That's the problem. Um, so I'm work. saying the... Mm, we often... Go to the San Tropez, where is the French Riviera? The thing is that you can use where for places, but you can also use which for places. You can use which for a lot of things. That's the problem, mm -hmm. all right? So I'm saying the best thing to do in this case right now is to think about it in Spanish so that you don't have any confusion. And later, I know it's not recommended, okay, to translate, but some topics you have to, and then they come naturally. So listen, Carla, what would it be? Okay, solemos, okay, solemos ir, is that okay? Solemos ir a Saint Tropez, donde está en el río, o el cual está en el río? Riviera. ¿Cuál está en el río? Ajá, exactly, so you cannot use where in that case. Which? Because some, uh -huh, exactly. So you're talking about the place, but it's different. It's not that the situation happens there, but you're talking about the okay. as a thing, as a as an object, kind of. Okay, one more, Carla. You'll have to translate it. Okay. ¿Por qué pregunté? Dice. No, it's okay. You can do it. Okay, this one is confusing too. Yes. Because it can be which, lo que sucede es que which puede sustituir casi que cualquier cosa. Mm -hmm. Aunque estemos hablando de tiempo, puede que sea which or when, depending on the context. Okay. So translate it and you will see. Okay, go ahead. You can do it. I am? Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Okay. And all? <laughs> yeah, just this one. July. Okay. And August are the um, months. Um, um, I don't know. <laughs> we are talking about time in this case, right? When? So, uh -huh, exactly. Um, July and August. Those two months are time. Mm -hmm. So July and August are the months when it's the hottest. Okay. Um, maybe with some practice you can understand that better. Write down all the options in the meaning. So that could help you. Okay, we are going to talk about dreams right now, guys. We're gonna have a small discussion before we do one more exercise. So look, here are the questions. In the first question, um, Veronica, where can you see the relative clause in the first question? Or anybody, where can you see the relative clause in the first question? That. The 
this first question. Where is the relative clause? That. Ah, that, okay. That. I heard got. <laughs> no, <but. laughs> okay, that is also a relative clause. We didn't include it. All right, so here are the options. What, when, which, etc. And also include that. Okay, very good. Where is the relative clause here, guys? Yes, excellent. Okay, what about here? Who? Who? Good. Here? That. That, that. awesome. That. Next one? That. Who? 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 Okay. That. 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 Who? 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 Okay, and so on. So this is the activity. We are going to talk about dreams, but dreams, not like your dreams in life, but your dreams when you go to sleep. Okay, we're going to talk about that. So you're going to have a conversation, but try to use the, um, try to use a relative clause. For example, uh, ask me the first question. Somebody, anybody. Read the first question. Do you know any food that make people sleepy? Okay. I have to use in my answer. I cannot simply say pitos, okay? <laughs> I can that is one, okay, but I cannot simply say that. I have to make a sentence, all right, and say one one dish that makes people Sleepy is, uh, yeah, but it's a dish, one dish, okay, that dish is pitos, okay, and or, what else, what else, guys, makes you sleepy, nothing, right, <laughs> Stephanie's like, mm -mm, no, <laughs> that's it, Sorry? Milk. Oh, but that's a drink. Okay, <laughs> okay. we can say, well, well, you, mm -hmm. we can say a drink that makes people sleepy is milk, 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 milk. Or, or I think chamomile, right? Mm -hmm. Chamomile tea, tea de manzanilla. Yep, that's one. So the answer has to be long using the relative clause. Is that clear? Discuss the questions, use relative clauses. Ready? Okay, take a screenshot of the pictures, I mean of the questions, and I will send it to you to WhatsApp anyway. Take a screenshot, everyone. We're gonna discuss in small groups of three to practice, okay? Let's practice right now. Let me make groups. Any questions? <clears throat> no? Okay. We're all good. Accept the invitation, please. And let's practice. Yo con sueño. <risa> ya me estaba durmiendo. <risa> ¿Quién más? Teacher, teacher. Ay. Teacher, yo me estoy durmiendo. Di que no estaba, yo dije, solo ha dejado la cámara ahí. No, sí, ya vine. Pero que así no me miraban dormido. <risa> y lo peor es que vamos a hablar de sueños. Ay, Dios, yo, yo voy a ser el primero que voy a ver. <laughs> okay, well, read the first question. Juan. Let me a few seconds. Check my watch. 
<clears throat> Do you know any food that make people sleep? Um, podemos decir la misma respuesta. <laughs> Yeah. Or discuss the second question. The uh, foods um, that make people sleepy. Uh... Do you have an answer, Daddy? Oh, ahorita las estoy buscando. <laughs> que ahorita las acaba de mandar. What question are you discussing? The first one or the second one? The second one. The second. Oh, okay. Okay, so I will answer the second one. Not friends, but I had family who likes to talk about about dreams so uh, we wake up in the morning and we discuss uh, if we have dreamed something weird then we talk about it uh, while breakfast so yeah I do know friends who like to talk about dreams mm -hmm. during so you discuss them during breakfast with your family yeah do you well, believe in <laughs> Do you believe that dreaming that dreams have meanings? Um not all of them, but sometimes. I mean, uh we have uh, unconscious mind. So sometimes uh I think that I get the power on us. So yeah, probably some of them. Some are pretty ridiculous and don't worth it, but yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. Some of them don't make any sense. Yeah. Yep, perfect. Okay, uh, read the next question. Rebecca, are you there? Yes. Oh, uh, you're frozen. Uh, sorry? You're frozen. It's okay. Go ahead. No, I have never. Um, in my case, um, I don't like the alarm because I like to to wake up um, late. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and for me, I don't. I I it's it's unnecessary the alarm. And in this moment, I I don't work. I'm not working. Okay. I don't work. I am not. I am not working. Yes, exactly. And in, in you're not working because of the quarantine or because you don't have a job. No, I I don't I don't have a job because in this year I graduate of the university. Mm -hmm. And how did you and I want to program? work, but in... what? How did you get in this program then? I can listen. Oh yeah. How did you get in this program? Can't hear. Michelle and Carla, can you hear me? Yes. Yes, I can. Oh, okay. It's probably her internet. I can back. listen, but I can listen, but cortado. Ah, it's breaking up. Oh. I think it's your internet. Okay, don't worry about it. Uh, let's do the next question. That's fine. And I'll check on all your students. I'll be back. <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> so when I am in the university, that's happened, yeah. 
Hello, teacher. Okay. Okay. The, um, have you ever had an alarm clock that suddenly, suddenly, suddenly. didn't suddenly. work? Suddenly, yeah. Did it make you late? Saira? Okay. Uh, yes, I. Uh, one day, uh, I don't hear my alarm clock. That um, didn't hear. Didn't hear. Yes, I I late uh, for my work. I was late. How late, Saira? Uh, Forty minutes. <laughs> Wow, <laughs> what happened? Yes. <laughs> uh, discount uh, the day, $10. Oh my gosh. <laughs> they discount the whole day? Uh -huh. I know, I hate yes. that. Yes. So you worked nine hours for no reason. Mm-hmm, yes. That's terrible. And you, yes. And you, Pedro? Yeah, me too. <laughs> what happened? But not not right now. So when mm, and, um, and some money and I I I don't understand uh, when she speak. <clears throat> okay, but in the a sentence could be, I know a person who talk in their sleep. Really? Who? The sister of Saul. Saul uh -huh. sisters. Ah, <laughs> you know Saul? No, but he talk about <laughs> his sister. <laughs> My best friend sings when he's sleeping. <laughs> Can you believe that? <laughs> Which song? He was singing an opera song. Or not opera. <laughs> <laughs> not opera, but um, a play song, like a musical. So he was saying, Nuestro día se va sin ninguna esperanza. And he woke up like this. <laughs> By the um, and you and I was glad, <laughs> yeah, I continue. Was glad. <laughs> <It's a good laughs> no, I was, I was scared. I was like, What is going on? Hey, hey. <laughs> they is dangerous, the people, really. Why, why do you think that <laughs> they're dangerous? Why, you know, yeah. Maybe um, in some case opens the door. Ah, uh, yes. those are sleepwalkers. They walk while they're asleep. <laughs> uh, yeah, they could be it's dangerous for themselves too. Not only for other people. Yeah, teacher. Yeah. Have a dude. A doubt. When doubt, doubt. Uh -huh. When we make a, a a question, for example, have you ever watched? a movie that made you have bad dreams, uh, how I can answer this? For example, if I never watch a movie that make me uh, bad dreams? Uh, okay, only... well, there is a situation here, Vladi. <laughs> okay, first you have the natural way of responding. Have you ever watched a movie that made you have bad dreams? No, I haven't. No, that I is haven't. the natural way, exactly. But I want you to use the relative clause. So you have to uh -huh. say, I have never watched a movie that made me have bad dreams. And that's it. Yeah, because you already used it. And the... If it's affirmative, can I say, I, I remember the scary movie. That made me have uh, bad yes. dreams. The, you can answer that in made any me... way, Vladimir. But right now, I want you to answer in, in a certain structure to practice, but it's not natural. Okay. So it's just to practice. 
Ok, teacher. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. Continue. I'll go check other stuff. Ok. Okay. I study in San Salvador, but but I live there when I was studying. Oh, sorry, I didn't understand. I was study in San Salvador, but I live in their place. No, I live in Metapan. My case, I was study in San Salvador. Yeah, I was studying in San Salvador, but I live in Metapan. Yeah, it's more difficult. In my case, I live in San Salvador when I'm studying. Oh, I bet it's better. Yeah, yeah, in only travel and mm -hmm. I am pregnant. Uh -huh. Only time. Yeah. Mm, I can understand that. <laughs> <laughs> I did that while where I was at the college, but mm -hmm. was because I was very tired for the, for my studies. Okay. I got, I, I got, I went to the bed very late and sometimes I get up very, very early. So um. during the day, all the time I was, I was sleeping. <laughs> oh no. Did you finish university, Rebecca? Yes, the last year. So you oh, can go to bed wow. now and rest. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> oh, I so know. difficult. <laughs> uh, were you studying and working at the same time? No, I was only studying, but I was in a uh, internal. <laughs> internship. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, in that's why. Uh, like an internship. Internal. Mm -hmm. That's why. Okay, I understand. Okay, did you practice enough? Yeah, I think. <laughs> All right, we can go back then. Let's go back. Okay. All right, welcome back. You guys practiced? You practiced speaking? Yes. Okay, share something interesting with me, please. Something you heard. Nothing interesting? Juanjo, one day. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> what happened to Juanjo? <laughs> uh, take a, a nap. For two hours. Uh huh. Where? In the work. At work. <laughs> wow. Okay. And what happened, Juanjo? Tell us firsthand. What did they tell you? Juanjo, you're on mute. Okay, well, not working. You know what? The worst thing that ever happened to me is I was working in a call center, right? And I was speaking with someone, with a customer, and I fell asleep while speaking. Imagine that. <laughs> that was terrible. So, yeah, the person was like, hey, hello, are you there? I was sleeping. Those were university days, very tough. That's why. <laughs> yeah. I was working full time and studying full time too, so it was terrible. Okay. Yeah. Uh Luke. We are gonna play a game. Pay attention, everyone. Pay attention to the instructions, all right? Because I don't want you to be lost later. Okay, so we're gonna have don't look at the images. I'm gonna send you an image right now, but don't look at it. Mm. Yeah, we can do it. We have time. Hold on. Which one are you? Okay, here it is. Don't look at the images. Don't open it, please. This time, don't do it. Okay, so we're gonna play guess the word. Okay, what is the meaning of guess? Adivinar. Adivinar. 
adivinar la palabra, okay? That's what we're gonna play, all right? Using, you have to use relative clauses, all right? Make sure you use relative clauses. To give a clue. What is clue? Pista. Pista, okay? Pista. Pista usando relative clauses. Okay, for example, um, you're gonna work in pairs. Okay, we have student A, A and student B. Student A and student B. In the images, you have student A and B. I sent two images right now. Okay, cuando estén en pareja, deciden quién va a ser A y quién va a ser B. No pueden ver las dos imágenes, solo la de A o de D. Okay, porque son secretas las de los estudiantes. So, no se can do that. And then, guess the word. For example, I will say it's an object. I will say it's it's a place where you study. Okay, what is my secret word? School, maybe. <laughs> School, exactly, yes. Okay, porque yo tengo estudiante A y en mi lista dice school. Yo no voy a decir school, voy a decir una pista. Como esta. It's a place where you study. Okay. Okay, as part of my list, I also have um, the word cup. Okay, pero ustedes no la pueden ver. So I will say it's an object, an object which you use to drink coffee. What's the answer? Cup. It's a cup, right? Yes, and that is a correct answer. Now, what if I say, as part of my secret words, I have September. And I can tell you, it's the month when, when we celebrate independence in El Salvador. What is the answer? September. September, September exactly. Is that clear? Yes. yes. Ready to play? Ok, primero deciden quién es estudiante A y quién es B. Ok. Y no pueden decir las palabras que tienen, sino pistas usando relative clauses. Ready? Ok. okay. Let's do that. Let's play. Let me see. We're going to be in pairs right now. Accept the invitation, please. Here we go. Uh, I don't know. A or B? A. Hey. Hey. I am the student A, Richard. A? Yeah. Okay. I B. Okay, Dick. Okay. Do you have it? Yeah, I think it's this. <laughs> <laughs> Don't look the mine. <laughs> okay. Uh, Don't look my answers. So you start. Okay. Let's start. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's a uh, slice. I no sé cómo hacer. Clouds fly in the sky. It's very clear. It's the color. Yeah, it's a color. Primero diga qué es, ok, un Baby. objeto, un lugar, un color, un eh. juego, qué, cuándo, dónde, ok. So, it's a color which you see in the sky. 
Oh. It's a color where you see in the, how say bandera? Ah, uh, in the flag, in the Salvadorian flag. Ah, uh, in the Salud. Salvadorian flag. Blue, very Blue. good. That's the answer, Michelle. Good job. <laughs> okay. In yes. The flag. Yes. Blue? It's blue. It's blue. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hi. Second picture. Uh, B. I'm uh -huh. sure B. Okay. Mm -hmm. I have to make a question, teacher. No, give clues. Dele pistas usando relative clauses. Primero dígale. It's a place, it's a month, it's an object, it's a color. Y luego, that, which, when, and the complement. Okay. It's a color. So it's the it's color. A... What picture do you have, Saul? Uh -huh. uh, student A or student B, Saul? What? Repeat, please. Uh, student A or student B? I, B. Uh, and you, Carla? Uh, and B. Ah, no, uh, okay. No, no. Yeah, uh -huh. Carla A, Saul B. B, mm-hmm. Okay, Carla, you're A. Uh-huh. Entonces, tengo que empezar con the, uh, picture two, ¿verdad? Mm, no, no, no. La que diga student A. No sé si es la primera o la segunda, pero que diga student A para usted. Second picture. Uh -huh. Ah, pero aquí dice student, I'm sorry, student A. Ah, no, no, es la otra. Es la otra, ¿verdad? Sí. Ahí me Ok. It's y a Saúl, color. Ajá, Saúl se queda con la que tiene. Uh -huh. It's a color, Saúl. Um, Which? Teacher. Yes. Really, really, I don't understand. Uh, I have two pictures in my cell phone. Yes, What's yes, yes, pero escojamos una, ok. Ok. Solo una, ok. La, la de usted arriba tiene que decir student B y solo esa va a estar abriendo y abriendo. Y la de Carla no tiene número, no, no dice nada. Dice, when student B says the correct word, esa va a ser la suya, Carla. Ajá, donde inicia con blue, ¿verdad? Sí, esa es la suya. <ríe> ya le dio la respuesta. <risa> Ok, la suya, Saúl, es la que empieza con key. Saúl. Ok, ok, ok. okay. Uh -huh. queda el internet. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ok, number two, Carla. Ok. Um, um, it's a year. Hmm. <laughs> That was good. Ok. The number five, uh, uh, I don't understand this. Mm. Can I help you? Yes, I, I am the B. Um, uh -huh. The number five, I don't understand that. And it's a five. food? Yes, it's a food, oh, no. <laughs> a city, or what's? No, change it. It's a nationality. It's the nationality of Thailand. Oh, yes. Ah, yeah. Okay. Change it. Go to the next okay. one. Okay. Yeah, it's yeah. a food. <laughs> the next one, it's a food. Um, uh huh, exactly. No, it's you... a food which. Okay. <laughs> it's a food which. Um, um, You, you eat with too much cheese. Mm -hmm. um, Pizza? <laughs> no. With a lot no. of cheese. Uh, yes, a lot of cheese. Um, and 
It's too long, I think. It's really long. Yes. Okay. Too is demasiado. So. I say really, really. long. Mm -hmm. But oh, too, <laughs> it's too long too. Oh, yeah, 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 you're right. It's too long, yes. Yes. So, with, uh, uh, I don't know, uh, tomato sauce. With tomato uh -huh. sauce? Tomato. Yes. Really, it's not, tomato it's not pizza. <laughs> oh, no. No, but that it's Italian. Like... It's Italian. Uh, yes. It's spaghetti. Yes. yes, it's spaghetti. That's the one. It's spaghetti, yes. <laughs> okay, so, uh, next. Yeah. Um, is an object you, you okay. use? when you are studying okay okay mm -mm -mm. is a woman who like who likes things who likes things jennifer <laughs> lopez I'm a, a single lady. I'm a single lady. <laughs> I heard this song, but I don't know <laughs> who is the artist, the single singer. I can help you. Uh, Carrie Be Perry. <laughs> Be Jones. Be Jones. Yes. I think yes. That's the one. Very good. <laughs> okay. Is a uh, is an actor who did a Titanic movie? Who we'll played the... Who starred Titanic, right? Yes. Leonardo. Children. Learn. Teacher. Mm -hmm. Teach, yes, teach. Mm -hmm. teach at the school. Okay. Um. Uh, It's um why all that it's um other it's a object it's an object it's a object um go go to to the street no and you Go to the school for a street where um, um, with every day. I don't know. <laughs> Say como is an object. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's actually a mean of transportation. It's transportation. Uh -huh. I, excuse me, it's a transportation. <laughs> yes. A mean of uh, bus, car, mm -hmm. bicycle. Solo hay de otro, un poco más We are back. Not everyone. We still have to take the picture. Oh my gosh. All right. Uh, did you enjoy the activity? Yeah. <laughs> glad he's like funny. Yeah. Funny. <laughs> All right. I'm glad. Let me see. I'm missing two people. 
open add. I had two more students at the beginning. What happened? All right, uh, let's take a picture, guys. I'll send it to your group for attendance. Here we go. Say cheese. There. Thank you. All right. Thank you very much. Tomorrow we will finish this topic. Okay. So be in class, okay. please. All right. Have a beautiful night. See you tomorrow. Okay. Good night. Good night. Bye. Bye. Good night.